same happened in Europe. It was a natural process. But those that partitioned state, Russian state, became and fell prey to the empire established by Genghis Khan. And Khan party came to Rus, pillaged all the cities, and different cities like Kiev and others lost their independence by northern, while northern uh, cities of Russia preserved part of their sovereignty. They paid tribute to, to the yoke. And l l later, the centralized Russian state became fledgling in, in northwestern part of Russia, and the southern lands of, of Russia were gravitating towards towards another center, the one of Europe, the Grand Lith Lithuanian Dukedom, Duchy, the Lithuanian Russian Duchy, as the Russian, the ethnic Russians constituted a major, a big part, and they were Orthodox in faith and they spoke the ancient Russian language then there, but later Poland, the Kingdom of Poland and the Grand Duchy of Lithuania were unified and another unification in spiritual sphere was signed and part of the Orthodox priests were now subordinate to the to Pope. So in those lands were transferred to the Polish and Lithuanian state, but for decades the Poles tried to uh, well convert uh, those those people, those Russians, trying to insert uh, entrench an idea that those were not specifically and fully Russian, trying to assimilate them. Ukraine means uh, the trim of the nation, the trim of the land, the border area. So some of them were, were border guards or something, but there was not about a specific ethnic group. So the Poles tried to assimilate the Russian population there and treated those lands in a tough or cruel even way, all that led to that part of the Russian lands struggle for their rights. They wrote letters to Warsaw claiming that their rights were to be up upheld.